Well, a new chapter is ahead for the Cleveland Metro Park Zoo. Today it revealed details of a major expansion project. And Manny Abraham brings us more on the upcoming new home for the park's gorillas and orangutans. This is home to baby Kayembe, born in October of last year. But it won't be long before he moves into his new home, and he won't have to travel very far. The Cleveland Metro Park Zoo revealed plans for its new 140,000 square foot indoor destination, expanding the zoo's rainforest. But if you think about the rainforest as it, as it sits right now, the footprint that's the, the rainforest, we're going to be over double that footprint. Right? The primate forest will add two new expansive multi-story habitats. It'll be the new home for the park's gorillas and orangutans. It comes after the zoo celebrated the birth last year of both a baby gorilla and a baby orangutan two of the world's most endangered primates. And we're going to utilize a roofing material that allows uh, light to come in. So the inside of these new gorilla and orangutan spaces will be like your outside. So even though it stays warm in the winter, it'll be sunlight, uh, great guest experience, ultraviolet light for the animals. So the expansion will be centered around the Cross Country Mortgage Forest Gallery, a new entrance way to the primate forest, immersing guests in the exhibit with interactive technology and multi-story play structures. Really working on the details and we'll have a lot more announcements and information to share as we get closer to being able to break ground. Construction is set to start next year, but it'll be part of a, a 10 year project and it's all leading up to the zoo's 150th anniversary. Russ? Nice new digs. Okay, Amanda Abraham, thanks mm -hmm. so much.